Alright guys, so we're doing another MetaZoo unboxing. In this one, I have uh, a few blasters that I picked up off of eBay. And the lot even included a serialized card and some cards that it looks like he had already, from the feel of them, he already had sleeved them. So we're going to take a look at those. I think the way we'll do it is we'll save two of the blasters for their separate video. We'll open up one and then we'll take a look at these cards here. So what I'll do is let me put these aside. We'll open up that one and let's take a quick look at the serialized cryptid camera. So I hadn't pulled the green one yet. I've pulled a few of the base ones and the first one I pulled was actually a medium's third eye base and this one he included 33 out of 99. So looks very nice. And then let's take a look at these other ones that he included. I appreciate that he sleeved them all and that he put them between cardboard to kind of keep them protected. Okay, let's just get both open. And yeah, I believe there's like 50 or so, 56 maybe. I can't remember the exact number off the listing. But for the price, it was it was nice of him to include these. It ended up being a pretty fair deal. Oh, they're both Rainbow Wizards. Let's go ahead and take a quick look. Rainbow Wizard, Agro Pelter, Squonk, Funeral Mountain, Terra Shot, Wapalusi, Wapalusi, Joint Snake, Ben B, Uncle Sam, Bat Squatch, Chaos Crystal. Tizzeruct, I don't have this art, so that's really nice to have. Sliver Cat, Giant Salamander, Dingbell, Moon Eyed People, The Spookster, Lava Bear, River Dinos, Black Cat, Old Green Eyes, The Charman, Sewer Alligator, Menehune, Kushtaka. Okay, so a lot of these we have. Basically, the only one I didn't have was this uh, Tizzeruct. A different art for him. Okay, we'll put those aside. And we have an X Fractor Rainbow Wizard, X Fractor Snow Wasset, X Fractor Squonk. I don't think I had that. Are these? Looks like they might all be X Fractors and Refractors. Yeah. A few of the same cards from the first stack Cactus Cat Refractor. Sinkhole Sam, both in the Refractor and X-Fractor, Power Up Red, X-Fractor, Pukwudgy X-Fractor. Okay, so I have a lot of these cards, but not an X-Fractor, so this is a really nice pickup hoop snake. Oh, I don't have one of these, an X-Fractor Chessy. That's really nice. Okay, Beast of Busco, Death Beam, Kentucky Hellhound. Ghost Deer. Okay, and then there are a few base cards. And I don't have this. Radio Silence. Looks like it's another one of the story cards. A rare peek inside Cryptid FM's radio tower. Moments before Mothman appears and melts it off the face of the earth. For whatever reason, radios in both FM and AM frequencies remain mostly functional following the shattering of the veil. Contracted. Sam forms his first contract with Dingbell, a beastie that specializes in light, in lightning, aura, and mischief. Born out of necessity, Dingbell acts as the engine for Lucy, Sam's new car. Dingbell is Sam's first true companion, even though he might not know it. And then we have this one. Okay, so a few base cards in there as well. Okay, cool. And then we'll put this aside too. And I guess we'll move on to the blaster. So let's get this open. And there's still a few cards that I'm hoping to pull. I think I mentioned in the video before this. I still have not pulled any Bigfoots. So that would be nice. I'd like a Hug and Molly. Salem Witches would be cool. So there's a few that... We haven't pulled for the collection. 
Ideally, it'd be nice to pull a serialized card. I haven't pulled any blacks, any out of fives, so that would be <laughs> a nice surprise. Okay, so as you know, these boxes come with four packs, and then there's four cards per pack. But some of these end up being five card packs if they have the exclusive x fractor that you can only get in these blaster boxes. So let's go ahead and start with this first pack here. And trying to avoid looking at the back. Okay. And we start off with a base killer clown. We'll show the backs as well. We have a base squonk. Midnight's Escape. This is a, is it a story card? Yeah, it is, and did not have this. Having escaped from Quimbley's, Sam is on the run inside Lucy, his new car. The searchlights lighting up from Quimbley's grounds cast dark shadows of beasties in flight too frightening to behold. Whoops. Okay, nice. And then we have a refractor bunny man. And I had never heard of bunny man before MetaZoo, but I mean, he's just so creepy. So cool. Okay, let's go on to the second pack. Pop that open. And okay, we've got a base ding bell. Uh, and I see now this will be a five card pack. I see the X Fractor back there. Giant Salamander. I prefer this art with the log in his mouth. Okay, our first X Fractor for this box Eternal Snowflake. I did not have. The X Fractor for this, so that's that's nice to have. And I didn't have this art for Chessie either, the Refractor. I really like this art. Like, looks like he's like blasting something out of his mouth. Very nice. And then a hide behind. Okay, two packs to go. Before we pull a serialized card. And let's see. Oh, does that want to come out? Okay, we've got a base rope right. Base Piazza Bird. Really love the art. Okay, we've got our Terror Bird X Fractor. Okay, and an Uncle Sam and new art for us for the collection. That's perfect. And one of the cards that we were hoping to get. A Salem's Witches. These poor beasties were turned evil by tragically being accused of magic that Indrid Cold was in control of casting. Very cool card. So happy to finally pull that one. Okay, so the last pack. Maybe we'll hit Bigfoot. Let's hope so. Alright, let's take a look. We start off with growth, base, and a cryptid camera. Nice. This cryptid camera, we've got the rainbow wizard, so we didn't have that. It's a nice pool. Okay. We have an X Fractor Lizard Man of Scape or Swamp. I don't think I had the X Fractor. And then Gumbaroo. I don't have this art for him either. I had recently pulled him in, I think, in the last video. Okay, and a Chupacabra base. And I did not have this art either. So I think the the biggest pull was honestly the cryptid camera here. But we did have some pulls that, like I said, 
I'm, I'm trying to build a collection ultimately so even you know pulling a base in these cards is nice just because it's, it's characters cryptids that i wanted so very nice so still have two boxes we'll go ahead and do that in the next video uh let me know what your favorite pulls been uh let me know what you've pulled and if you're enjoying metazoo as much as i am but until next one thanks for watching